Good morning, Steve Free in Chicago with the morning grain comments. A mixed trade overnight. Beans now up a penny. I've had a range of a low of 15.37 to a high of 1553. Corn market down a penny at 679 with a range of 676 to 682. And Casey wheat's down nine cents at nine dollars. Had a range of 896 to a high of 911. Stocks look like to be open higher, dollars lower. Crude's about unchanged. In the um, overnight trade, we saw um, the first um, high headline was that there was some rain in Argentina that was better than expected. When we look at the maps right now, you can see that Buenos Aires, South Buenos Aires, had some heavy rains, and Cordoba, and West, especially Western Cordoba, had some good showers. And so that offered resistance uh, to the bean complex. This is not a necessarily a drought break breaker, and some of the central and north Argentina missed out on these rains. So in Brazil, uh, some pretty good rains um, in western Mato Grosso do Sul, uh, northern Paraná, um, also in uh, southern Minas Gerais. And uh, Brazil soybean prices are still below. U.S. We had a rally on Friday on word that maybe Brazil um, bought three to four cargoes of U.S. golf beans for their reserve. Uh, we also noted that uh, there was concern over the weekend about the escalation of the offensive that Russia had in uh, eastern Ukraine. Um, I think that the corn and uh, wheat market actually uh, saw a little bit of selling overnight. Uh, because, number one, it looks like Ukraine might be holding their ground. Number two, um, that uh, Ukraine is uh, is helping um, <clears throat> replace their grids that were destroyed by missile attacks. And that sh ships are being loaded in Ukraine. And uh, so that's offering a, a tad bit of resistance uh, to the market. We also note that um, when we look at the forecast here in the U.S., uh, looks like parts of uh, the Southern Plains is going to see some showers over the next 24 hours. The best rains will be south, uh, east Nebraska, uh, northeast Kansas, with could see as much as an inch in amounts. The rest of the Southern Plains could see maybe a two-tenths to four-tenths of an inch of rain. So, uh, <clears throat> again, we're seeing the Kansas City market uh, back off uh, both uh, from the Ukraine uh, news and also because of the chance of showers across the southern plains. Long term, uh, the bears still want to talk about uh, lower export demand for corn, beans, and wheat. They still want to talk about normal uh, 2023 U.S. summer weather and higher carryouts that will limit the upside in prices.